This is Lemmy with RevZilla, here to talk to you today about Final Drive Chains. Now I've made quite a few videos on Final Drive Chains, I've written a jillion articles, and yet there's one question that still pops up fairly frequently. Lem, what kind of chain should I get? Plain or sealed? It's a great question, and there's a couple things I think you need to think about if you're trying to answer that for yourself. First thing you need to think about is that a sealed chain does eat up a little bit more horsepower due to greater friction than a plain chain will. Because sealed chains have the additional friction of all of the seals in all of the links and rollers, well, they don't transfer quite as much power back there. They eat up a little bit of power in and of themselves. So if eking every last bit of horsepower out of your bike and moving it back to that rear tire is important to you, plain chain wins. Second thing I think you need to consider too is there's a cost difference between these two items. Sealed chains just cost more money. If you only have a couple nickels to rub together, again, a plain chain, probably in your future. Third thing I think is important for a lot of people to think about too is your particular riding condition, the scenarios under which you're riding. To me, there's nothing that kills a chain more quickly than grit or dirt. If you happen to be riding in a very dirty, dusty environment, well, I have to be honest with you, I think that can be particularly damaging, especially to a sealed chain. Yes, a sealed chain will keep dirt and grit out for longer than a plain chain. However, once that stuff makes its way into the lubricating grease, it's almost impossible to clean it back out. And that means that typically a sealed chain dies quickly under those conditions. Now you might be thinking I'm exceedingly bullish on plain chains and that's not necessarily true, especially when we consider item four you need to think about. And that's your propensity to actually care for your chain. Look, a plain chain in order to give good service life really needs lots and lots of care and feeding. You're gonna have to clean and lubricate that chain very, very regularly. If you happen to know that you're a rider who's not going to do those sort of things, you need to buy a sealed chain. Take the extra money out of your wallet and plunk down for one simply because it's gonna serve you a lot better and you're gonna get lots longer life than you did if you purchased a plane chain. There's absolutely no shame in saying, hey, it's a little bit easier to have a sealed chain in a bike. It's why so many motorcycles come from the factory with sealed chains on them now. There's absolutely nothing wrong with saying, that's the thing for me because I don't like cleaning and lubricating a chain. I'll tell you a secret, I hate it too. So hopefully that helps you answer the question on which style final drive chain might be right for you and your bike. Thanks for checking out this video. I'm Lem, I'm out of here.